Hello there, I am Giant Cool and we're Pokemon Sun. In the last part, we got here to this area, which I can't even look up because my Rotom Dex is uh, not working right now, apparently, in this dimension. We uh, never turned to this legendary Pokemon, we also met with Lily. We activated this, going through the secret portal by standing at different parts of the water system or something that like we had last time. I have race up front, let's just continue on. I, I, it won't give us a hand where to go next, though, because the Rotom Dex is turned off and stuff. The Rotom is not working right now. Here's Guzma. I'm this team's cool boss and will never have been scared to, of nothing, no, nobody. Heck, I live my life making people scared of me. So listen, what's the big deal, bad Guzma has to say? Okay. You are stupid. That's not very nice. How in the world did you even get to this place? I've got no idea how you did it, but here you are. It's all dark here, and I have no clue what's going on in both the beasts everywhere. I tried to catch one of those things. But I didn't look out for you, did it? Okay. What possessed me? Okay, that's what happened to me. Uh, but my body was my, my my body, my mind. I started running wild, and I couldn't do anything about it. I was like it became someone else, and I finally felt the fears feel like they were terrifying. That's terrifying. Okay, I may be the team's skull boss, but I've never been scared of nothing or nobody. But that lady, she had gotten in love with she was way far gone. She lost her mind over those ultra beasts. There's no talking to her. There's no taking talking to her. No reasoning with her. She was just gone. It doesn't change anything. I still have to go. These things are creepy. Very, very creepy. Oh man, these are very creepy. I don't, I don't like to. I don't want to deal with them, honestly. But whatever. Look at it. Uh, the world of my ultra beasts. A world where not the only thing that exists is the world between Nihigyo and uh, myself. So beautiful, so delicious. This is a, the real paradise. And you, and, and yet yeah, you, you must continue to protect, to pester me. I am sick of you, sick through and through. Who told you that you could come here to the perfect, beautiful world of my beast and me? Uh, think about. What you are saying, what about Mr. Gesma? Don't you care what happens to him? Just leave. I don't need you here. I don't need you any longer. It's a terrible thing to say to your daughter. <laughs> Look at you. Look at this beautiful world that I finally come to. You have. You want me to go back to that world? That's what you've come to bother me for. Even you cannot be that stupid. You always do that. You just like what you did back in the Anyther Paradise. Only thinking of yourself and what you want. What? I uh, and why you shouldn't. Okay. I can live here with the world filled with only the things that I love, and I will live here. I 
I don't care if you are my child or not. I don't care if you were loyal to me or not. I don't care if you were the best Pokemon there is in the world or not. It's uh, if you're not beautiful enough to be worthy of my love, then I don't need you. That's right, all I need to exist in my world are the things that I want to have with me. Everything else is just a bother to me. I am the one who, I am the one who is sick of you, mother. Children. Children is not just things that belong to their parents. Pokemon are not just things that a trainer can do whatever they want to. I am alive. Cosmog is alive. We are not things for you to collect. We, not made, we, we are not made for the, you to be just discarded. To just discard when you get bored with us. This is terrible, mother. You are terrible. Terrible me? How am I different from any Pokemon trainer? Like you, little friend there. What do you... What, what do you do with a Pokemon you can't see? You can't use. You remove it from your party and so be and see, please. Enough with these fools talk, Lily. I will never forgive you for stealing Cosmog from me. Never. Back when you were small, you would always listen to everyone. I said everything I said without question. For a time, for a time, even you were ador adorable to me. But you've, but you changed. You became ugly. Ever since you met this boy, Stephen, I wanted you to defy, and wanted to defy your own mother, Stephen. You're a hateful little trainer. How do you intrude upon the world that was meant for Nahigoyo and me? It's not to be born. In the Nilgo power, I will show you how to wrong you were to come here. That baby boy, that kind of looks like a baby boy. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let's battle that thing. Can't be good. Challenge by youth present. Okay, she's just turning herself into like a Pokemon or something. Okay. I want to see how much the psyche does on this thing. It's all 50 in female. So if we love higher on this thing, could be psychic, I guess. Okay. If it's like a gas. Oh great, this is okay, I'll switch up to energy, I guess. Oh, okay. Skip a brick break. I 
Of course. So I'm having some bad luck here. Let's go back to Ace. Supposed defense was good. Void the attack, of course. Here, let me look up something real quick. Let's go to Umbra, I guess. Well, then again. Moon Blast is going to be super effective. Let's go to yellow, I guess. For Thunderbolt. Isn't good. This this Clefable is gonna be swept the rest of my team. I don't want any poison type moves or set or or steel type moves, but good thing I have the prowess on there. I'm hoping uh, Moonlight only has like five PP. Try psychic, I guess. Cool, cool, awesome, nice. Avoid oh, the tag, of course you did. This is not good. I might lose this battle. Have to try Umber. For the attack, of course, it did. I don't like this at all. Are you kidding me? That stupid minimize screwed everything up. This sucks. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Come on. This battle. I don't want to lose battle. I'm probably gonna lose battle. I'm like, half my team's fainted. I don't know what to do. I have nothing I can really do. If 
we could just stay paralyzed, that'd be great. Come on. Come on, are you kidding me? I hate this. Just stop for what? Oh my god, this sucks. This cafe was being so freaking annoying. I'm gonna look something up here. So let's use the psychic. Uh, use the or um or um poison type, I think. Poison and fire. Poison and steel. Sorry, let me look that up again. Poison still types moves to super effective. Okay. Cool. I don't have any poison still type moves, sadly, though. I'm gonna have to teach one temporal item on my Pokemon. Just for this fight. Switch the ninja, I guess. Oh, thank you. That might actually be helpful. I don't know if this is the right move, but I'll try it. That kind of helps me out because it does damage, a chunk of damage to you. How would you do that? That's like, what the heck, man? You stole my gas. Shell Boss shouldn't do that much. Nice. 
nice. Let's go ninja, I guess. Small attack's gonna be a pain in the butt. Did a little bad fast on just another like, good drill pack then. I used a cover, of course. It's getting really annoying. Well, one more drill pack should do it, but then again, maybe two more because it's just for getting some more health. That it switch out the sass changes uh when it went back to the original states which is just the original of you know numbers of the stats that's actually up a lot so i think we're able to win this battle now i think that's the last pokemon i didn't get that 52 awesome what's a what's a look at We'll stay in. Give another drop pack. Pedal dance. Hopefully that's hopefully Ninja can take it. Nope, of course not. Okay. Let's 
just fun to understand. Okay, cool. I think we won the battle. Yeah, I'm based on that 52 awesome. Alright, let's go. That was a long battle though. Help us. I was in the last part, but yeah. Mother. Mother. Holy. Did you start becoming beautiful? Here's Gladian. I don't know if that's Gizma. Okay, never mind. What now? What's going on? And just when things were getting good. There's so many Megali goers. Lila. Oh man. She's disappeared, huh? Back outside somehow. Okay. I was consumed, so I assembled all what I could do. Oh, um, and what do I do? What do I find but the ocean Pokemon and a strange hole in the sky? Uh, however, I believe to see you all unharmed. Hapu! Is your mother? You came, you there, big fellow, and carry the lady, will you? She's a weak, but not. But do not believe that she is uh, seriously harmed. No, sh we shouldn't take her to be treated directly. Huh? Oh. Stephen, you are done well in guiding Lily, though she is not a trainer. And Lily, you have, you have too grave. Lily, you too grave, too gave at your best. Now we we will wait for you down below. When you are ready, come find us. Thank you, thank you, Hapu. Hapu. So like Oh, I've never wanted to do this with uh, with help you get back to your own home. But on to your own home, but instead you helped me over and over. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, uh. Morning.
what is that? Well, what is it? I don't know. Which one? The one. Shall I guess what it is you're trying to tell us? You. You want to keep traveling together with Stephen and me, isn't it? Well, uh, yeah. Yeah, interesting. Looks like I was right. Of course I was. After all, we've been together so long. We're family now, aren't we? Of course, you can tell how I feel. You feel. My camera's going crazy with the whole little frame thing. Because I feel the same. We met so many people that traveled around all, uh, all of Aloha's islands. Professor Gukui and Professor Burnett. Uh, uh, Kunahasa, Kunahala and his seconds and how. And of course, the hero appeared to save you when the Spiros attacked you, our own Steven. And so many other people too. I don't know what the world you came from is like, but well, is pretty great too. Of course, you want to see it all. It's just that Kanahawa told us you can go so many places and meet so many Pokemon and people, and they will eat, will enrich your life. Well, uh, and ah, uh, but not with me. I'm not a trainer, Nebby. I can't take you on the adventures you want. I can't believe, give you the fierce battles you want. Steven, I want you to face Nebby as only a trainer as an only a trainer can, and I want you to give it a ball to call home. I know this is Nebby what Nebby wants. I it doesn't want this journey. It doesn't want this journey with you to end, and I want you to grant it this this wish, this wish. Okay, I'm gonna end the part of right here. So this has been on Pokemon Sun Walk through part. The next part will take on uh, Nebby. I don't know if it's a fighter or what, but that's pretty cool. We're gonna try to catch it in the next part if we can. So if you can go again, I'm gonna go again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys next part of Pokemon Sun Walk through Guide.